So learning to draw blood from a model rat might be something you would do if you were training to become a, an animal technician or research in a lab. So before you actually start working with live animals, you need to be properly licensed and that means that you're fully trained and have past examinations to show that you actually know what you're doing when you're working with lab animals. So a rat has veins that run along either side of his tail and you can see that darker color along either side. Uh, and we have our model there, so you can actually see the veins along each side. So if I get the tip of the needle in, and get through the plastic and into the vein, and you can kind of just feel it go pop as it gets into that vein space there. Pull back on the plunger, and we should start to get a little bit of blood in there. So that's what we're going for, and just gently pull that back out. So if I do that on our larger model, again, we're going to make sure the tip's going down, go into that nice blood vessel, pull back a little bit on the plunger, and then gently withdraw the needle. Okay, and cap our needle so it's nice and safe.